Each machine should have a safety feature that detects an obstacle under the carriage and prevents further travel that could potentially damage the machine. This part of the machine should be free to move up and down easily. This will engage the safety switch in the event there is an obstacle below the film carriage. If there is an issue with the safety switch or the pan intended to engage the switch, the machine will operate like this. There are four common reasons this could happen to a machine. These screws should not be tightened. Tightening any of these screws can cause an SIC error to display. To fix the issue, simply adjust any screw that has been tightened so that the lock nut is at the end of the threads. If the edges of the safety pan are bent or dented, it may not release easily from the carriage frame, causing an SIC error. Be sure to remove any indentations that can cause this. Other times, the safety switch can be bumped during film loading. This can cause the switch to change position and constantly be engaged, causing an error. The switch should be positioned straight up and down vertically. If it is crooked, then you'll be able to change its alignment by hand. The switch can also be knocked into its lowest position with the film. Loosen the two mounting screws and adjust the height so that the safety pan only triggers the switch in the up position and secure the switch in place. Finally, there are situations where the safety switch can be triggered and the switch head becomes stuck. Loosen the mounting of the switch and ensure proper operation of the switch head, then secure back into place. Once the cause of the SIC error has been determined and fixed, perform a reset on the machine by pressing the reset button. The machine should set the carriage to the home position and be ready for use. If the machine does not reset or displays an error, please refer to our video regarding the carriage being stuck at the top of the tower.